Hey, buddy. How are you, buddy? Give it up for one of my little Hulkamaniacs. And I'm going, oh, no, fucking Hulk Hogan. And my lad's like, no. <laughs> and uh, he's going, you're, you're little, one of my little Hulkamaniacs. Donovan's like, yes. And he looked up at me and he said, what about you, big man? Are you one of my Hulkamaniacs? And I was like, yes, I am. <laughs> yes, I am. Well, can you define kinky? That's just a, sh a shoulder Odd shrug. sexually. Odd sexually? Yeah. You know, uh, we got Coca-Cola on the line. Uh, what? We got co what? Coca-Cola, I'm gonna sue you. It's like, me? Coca-Cola? Fucking wankers. Why? Where we're at, where are we? At this story. And I'm talking to some total stranger who neither of us ever met in our entire lives ever. There's a band on and this bloke's gone blah, blah, blah. So he's chatting away. And then he's, he's here, this block. And in between the pair of us comes this pair of sunglasses. And he goes, don't talk to him. So I thought this guy must be a journalist or summer. So this bloke's a bit freaked out and says, don't talk to him. I said, why? He goes, he's got nits. <laughs> Dead straight face, right? So the bloke didn't hear him. I had to leave, right? And I had to walk like 50 foot away from him. So this poor block is like, you know, thinking, that... well, no, he's just thinking, well, hang on a minute. I was just talking to Noel Gallagher a minute ago, and his brother comes on, the pair of them just walks in opposite directions. He got nicked. And then he's going, and they jump as he's as as walking off. You ever used a soda stream? <laughs> no. Size that fucking burger. Look at the fucking size of it. He's going to eat it, and then he's going to get a t shirt. Yeah. He's going to get a t shirt. And maybe if he doesn't get a t shirt, he's going to get a picture on the wall mm -hmm. in fucking some place in the middle of nowhere. You've got bread and you've got beans. <laughs> got yourself beans on toast there, mate. <laughs> and the other fella, the textures and the flavours are, whoa, it's just oh, magnificent. <laughs> it's all a bit flannel, really, isn't it? Flannel. Right, well, I'm getting a fucking chimp, OK? I don't give a fuck what anyone says. And I'm getting a top hat and I'm getting a fucking car. And guess what? I can't even fucking drive. It goes, Used to be like, fucking day, wallop. Toilet seats. Now as you're well. just like, Psh. it's kind of taken away one of the great. The point isn't being made. Yeah, it's taken away one of the great northern male pastimes. I'm about to insert the cheese. <laughs> Leave the Stand room. Back. Leave the room. <laughs> no one can know the magic <laughs> trick. And he, and, he, and he had the shoe. And I remember we come off stage just waiting at the front door for this guy to walk past with one shoe. We were going to annihilate him. <laughs> And uh, of course we never. You couldn't go to the shop for us and get some cigarettes, could you? And they'd be like, can I get an autograph? I'm like, if you go to the shop and get me 60 Benson and Hedges. Get some <laughs> and some Rizzler papers and the newspaper. Oh, fuck sake. Oh, it's fucking, can't wait to get a fur coat. Fucking top hat, furry dog. I'm gonna be the bollocks. I was taking it all in, man. I was like, yeah. Pass me the guitar. Yeah. What's that word? Acquiesce. What does that mean? Uh, well, the. Shut up! <laughs> Do you feel as a. My youngest is either nine or seven. But definitely not eight. It could be eight. There's nothing better than lying that on a Sunday, kind of lying in a nondescript hotel room in fucking Buffalo, hungover, watching three games of American football while eating. Fucking mashed potatoes and f***ing for breakfast. There's nothing. There's nothing better than that. It was the kind of thing that I get talked into on holiday from time to time. The horse. The horses was equally as horrific. <laughs> <laughs> so there was just me and him on the whole of this floor and the CIA. But when I finally got to meet the king, I don't know whether I watched too much Scooby Doo, which I probably do. <laughs> But I thought he'd have a grass skirt on. <laughs> <laughs> and I did. And, I, and he kind of got into the lift where I was there, and he's like, some guy from Buckinghamshire, he went, oh, hello, you're the rock star. And I was like, uh, I'm the drums. <laughs> How did you know he was a king, did he tell you? If I had a gun, I'd, I'd shoot a hole into your bum. <laughs> <laughs> Which is kind of... I see a future there. Yeah. This guy turned his name was Ramon. But I found it amusing because he was not in any way Latino, he was Korean. Right. Ramon, you know. And uh, what's my point? My point is he was, he was staggered by my hair. He's I've got crazy. three hairs growing out of every hole as opposed to one.